What's up guys? John Howley. Hope you guys are doing well. Uh, something I'm thinking about today, I've just gotten back from the gym and I'm thinking about you know, what, I'm, what I'm doing today and so on and so forth. Um, guys, here's a, single, here's a tip for you guys to be, to, you know, here's a tip for you guys to actually get a lot more done during the day. How do you maximize your time? How do you, how do the successful people really become successful and how do they maximize their time really? Here's the thing. I don't say I do this all the time because I don't and I need to become more disciplined in it. But here's the thing. If you chunk out your time and you set blocks up, that way you can get a lot more done. For example, my block time would be, I firstly I'd get up and I'd have a block time for a bit of exercise, a shower, a cold shower, a bit of meditation, green tea, a bit of lemon water. That's block time, right? For the first block time, I'm doing that. Next block time is what? For my trading, for my trading and investing. So that's my block time. Then for the next hour or so, probably the next couple of hours, I'm doing that. The next couple of hours, what am I doing? I'm actually off to the gym, um, doing a gym workout, so on and so forth. Come back, then what's my next block time? Then I have a block time, say in these block times, obviously you start the range from four o'clock in the morning, right? Four o'clock in the morning, boom, I'm on. And then from around about, times right now, about 8, 8.30, somewhere around there right now, I'm gonna go up and have a, have a shower and then I'm gonna simply look at my outcomes. What are my outcomes and what do I need to do? What's all these little things I need to get done? What's these major things and tasks I need to accomplish? And then I set a block time out. So basically from nine straight through to 12, I would, you know, nine, 10, 11, 12. Yes, that's 12 or even one, right? Four hours, four hours is good. So say nine through to one, I'd actually block time. That means 100% focus on what I'm doing. Now, I won't be 100% working all the time. Probably every half an hour to an hour, I'll get up, I'll have a drink, I'll stretch, I'll breathe, I'll jump around, um, and then I'll get back into it. Say so from nine through to one, I'll do that. And then I'll just be bam, 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 getting all these things done, writing all these things out, doing all these things to actually move forward in life. And then around one o'clock, I might, might take some time off. Then I'll be back in the, then, then, by that time off, then I'll be getting ready to, to trade the Australian market. I trade the end of the day Australian market as well too. So probably around three o'clock, three o'clock in the afternoon, um, my time, it's, around, it's, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's, it's around that time, it's around that time. Um, so generally I, I actually like to, uh, I like to start trading that around about 2.30, three o'clock to actually start seeing when there's entry signals and then and then three and then I'll and then I'll trade that up right to about four o'clock in the afternoon and and then if I have some more stuff I want to get done then maybe in the afternoon um, what I'll do is in the afternoon say from four through to about six or seven or eight if I have a lot of stuff on I need to get done that day I'll use that next block time to get things done now you're probably going to John how do you stay how does your energy level stay up through through the day through there well it never used to but now I've simply cut my carbs down to virtually zero, and I'm, and I'm using, a, I'm very high fat, so I take a lot of eggs, avocados, uh, fish oils, um, nuts, all these healthy fats is actually help, helping me sustain throughout the day, and it's not, it's not, it's not crushing me as much. Secondly, what I'm doing is in the afternoon, I'm making sure I'm getting um, some more lemon water, I'm getting some more green drinks, I'm getting another two or two, one to two liters in the afternoon, so around two, three o'clock, the reason why we drop is because we probably haven't had a lot of liquid in three or four or five hours. So then my energy level rise back up and then I can probably get a lot more stuff done. Again, I don't do this all the time guys, but this is something if you want to get a lot of stuff done, there's two major blocks there. So as you can see, I have many blocks in my life, but I have, my big block is getting out and trading first in the morning, US stock market. The next block is, is, is basically gym and workout. And then the next block is, is trading, the, trading the Australian market, one thing at a time. Then the next block is maybe working on something else. Make sense? So you can get a good, if you block it out like that time. Now, obviously I'm not working all the whole time. So as you can see, from about one, one through to around about three, that's generally my time off, so to speak. You know what I mean? Um, uh, where I will be, uh, that's that's my time off where I'm probably relaxing and stuff like that. Um, and uh, and just, just chilling out, maybe watching a little bit of TV, maybe not, um, and just chilling out. And so from that, then I go through there. So. But most of the time, I like to I like to try to get I like to try to start winding down around about seven o'clock because by eight thirty nine o'clock, um, I actually want to be falling asleep because I get up at you know three thirty four o'clock most mornings to get my day started. So there we go, guys. That's how successful people truly maximize their day. Now, in those block times that you're actually working on, like for my block time, 
morning is trading, um, three o'clock in the is, is trading as well too. Say from nine through to one, that block time, you, it's uh, first thing when you have a look at the block time, you write, what, you look at your outcome, what is your exact outcome you're trying to achieve, like major goal. Then write out what are the major steps you need to get done and start to work on those major things you need to get done in that block time. And boom, 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 you start to move forward. So be outcome focused, and this is how you can get so much more, and this is how successful people get so much done in one day. And that's where a lot of people, successful people can make more progress in one day than most people probably do in a month. So there we go, guys. Talk to you soon.